13 to give us 13 so this space is not enough i'm gonna shift it because i need to add extra two inches let's get, get prepared, prepared. Get prepared. Shh. listen listen carefully, carefully. Pay attention. 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 fine pencil sided slit skirts i'll have to get my length the length of my client is uh the length of my client is 45 so this is the front pattern that i'm drafting oh my goodness it's 45 on the dots anyway it is pencil now. so here's like it is up and new it's 45 on the dots so i'll have to add bands to cover up for the lost inches so i mark on the hip the hip line is at 10 the knee line is at is at 22 the round hip is 52 52 by 4 will give us 13 to give us 13 so this space is not enough i'm gonna shift it because i need to add extra two inches after the normal this thing so i measure this is my 13 i'll have to add two inches and it will come to 15 so let me shift my fabric to make sure it is 15 on the dots. So I mark 15 here. This is the space with which I walk. And the waist is, uh, the skirt waist is 47, approximately 48, which will give us uh, what? 48 will give us 12 which will give us 12 and I add 2 inches allowance is now 14 ok so I did 14 here come to the knee length I will do 13 and a half so I removed 1 and a half from this the hip is 15 and I did 13 and a half here because it's a pencil skirt, I need it to be coming down pencil. So since here is 13 and a half, as I go down, as I go down, I'll make it 12. That's the way I do my pencil skirt. At least you can see there is a fine pencil sketch shape here so I cut so this is my pencil sketch and because it has a sided slit I have to I'll have to cut the back first use this pattern get my back pattern then after that I'll now give it the sided slit so this is the pattern i've placed it to get the the back and i have to make sure that everything is equal by the side here so i draw my chalk to get the pencil shape when i come up here i'll have to use everything here because it will have that so i slit first then from here I am not going about 2 inches Can we cover up for that? I can shape the girl They are caught up here I'll see it in a letter, you see. Oh, let me go see. So, this is the zipper and the button. So, this is the zipper allowance. I want to cut it down now. I hope you are not. I hope you are not. I hope you are not. So, this 
is the front pattern, this is the back pattern. And a foil band can open. So let me just notch the zipper so that whoever that will sew it will know that this is the zipper. And this is the button allowance. Then I have to slant my center front by three quarter half inch, three quarter or half inch because it's the front. So I'll now do the band. I'm supposed to add extra here, but because this is Ankara, the length is just 45 inches. So from the band now, I'll now add the allowance that I'm supposed to add here from the band. So time to do the band. You can see, I have to draw my baseline. This is my baseline. Then I raise here by one and a half inches. Join it to this place. Here will be the zipper and here will be the side. So by the zipper, because I lost some allowance to the skirt because it is uh, Ankara. So I have to, instead of three inches, the band is two inches plus allowances, it is three. So this time by the center, I will add extra one again to cover for the bomb bomb allowance. So it will now be four. And then, then when I come to this side, it will be three. So I will join. The waist is, uh, this is zipper, one and a half, and this is for the waist, which is uh, 12, and I add extra two inches up on the dot, on the dots. Then the, the high waist is 43, 43 divided by four bone, can we have 44? The high waist is 44 and it is 11. So take out zipper from here. I get my 11 and I add extra two inches. So this is, this is it. So let me use it and get for the right side. One will be right and one will be left. Then I have to draft for the front. It's almost the same thing. The difference is that no allowance is added. It's three inches, three inches. Three inches throughout, and I cover it in. So I do 15 here, and I do 14 here. Okay, mm -hmm. one and a half. Okay, can we move if I'm going to zip it? So the high waist is 44, which will give us 11, and I add 2 inches. Then the skirt waist is 48, which is 12 plus 2 inches, is now 14. So, and I'll cut it. This is, this is my front band. I'll use it. I'll get it twice because I'll have to add in the face. So time to do the slits. Time to do the fine sleeve. So I have to do the sleeve length now. Because it has two inches band, I'll remove my two inches up and mark it at 20. I want the slit length to be at 20. So, by this down, I'll make it where you minus the allowance two inches, which I added to be here. So, this is the relevance in the clip. I'll have to minus four inches down here and I'll drag it up. 
six inches. Then I come here, cover it in. So this is my slits. I'm gonna roll this now. Thanks for watching.